If you've got a nice shiny Sony ZV-E10 and you want to protect it, which you should, the screen is one of those things that picks up a lot of dirt and fingerprints and all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to use this that I got. And let's see how easy it is to fit this. So we get a cleaning cloth, we get wipes, uh, wet and dry. Those are the wet wipes. Is there a dry one? Oh no, we don't get one no. And then these dust pad things to uh, peel any dots, dust off. But let's have a look at the actual thing itself. It was already clean because it's, you know, I look after these things. And that looks dry already. Oh, okay, so the alcohol dries pretty quick on that. So that side is the outer edge that will be the bit we press on for, you know, well, not touch. And that's the sticky bit. So let's see if I can go a bit closer. So what I'm going to do is just look at the overall positioning. Yep. Okay, so there's a lip here on the LCD screen, so I'm going to position this there and then drop it down. And that should be about right. So if I take this off now, so I'm peeling it underneath, as you can see. And now I want to position that accurately as I can. Drop it down and touch it in the middle where it should start to... You might be able to see, you can just see it doing the um, air bubble thing. Now there is one still there, so I'm going to use this cloth to try to get rid of it. So that's quite good actually, that was easy enough to do. But we do just have that little bit of a, an air bubble, which I'm going to put... Oh, okay, that's gone. Can you see? Didn't take much at all. That was really easy to fit actually. No air bubbles, absolutely no air bubbles on that at all. That I'm very happy with. And I've got two refills here. That was the make I got. Links below if you want to have a look. Bye.